welcome back to Nightly Nerds. I'm Tote. And I'm Ginger. And we're playing... Pokemon Fire Red. Fire Red. All right, so if you remember... Team Rocket. On, on the last Grunt. episode, we... Uh, we uh, we went to the top of the ghost tower. Oh, is this the 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 battle at the top of the ghost tower? Yeah, I forgot to change wow, my Pokemon. Wow. All right, so who who should we throw out there? Who should we throw out? Um, Brian. Um, Brian. Um, Brian. Brian. It's actually probably a good choice. Oh, is it? <laughs> no, it's not very effective. You blap. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I think it was a good. Choice. Well, so uh, Umbreon as a Eevee evolution. Um, it's Brian. Um, it's Brian. Um, uh, is a very defensive Pokemon. So like his uh, his natural high stats are like special defense, defense, and HP. So uh, actually, we'll keep him out. After this battle, I'll, like I'll, I'll show you what I mean though. Like, so. Um, Brian, use faint attack. Um, Brian. <laughs> Sorry. Oh. Uh, I wonder what he's gonna send out this time. Oh, a Golbat. Oh, he's like. Arr. Yep. It's the same <laughs> same joke. Game grips. Oh, did they? <laughs> um. Hi guys. I remember he's like. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, I'm, I'm here to have a fight with you. A <laughs> very Muppet um, thing going on there. I, 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 I tried to be hypersonic and it just didn't work. Come at me, bro. Uh, oh no, you've defeated me. My only weakness. <laughs> My only weakness is defeat. <laughs> uh, oh, so that, that reminds me of a freaking amazing These gym. robot nuts. That amazing Jim, this is amazing Jim Jeffries joke. So you like, you know how... People will go up in arms about like the stupidest things sometimes. Okay. Um, yeah. Like uh, defending Kingdom Hearts. No I'm joking. Uh, no. <laughs> Just joking with like you. Like an example of uh, of getting mad at parents for the choice of you know circumcising their baby. Oh. And and so, getting mad at that. Yeah. People people will go up in arms about that pretty hard. Yeah. Well, um, it's. Yeah. Uh, I don't get up in arms about it, but I think it's kind of a stupid thing to do. Um. Uh, look at his uh so his attack is 52 but his defense special defense are like close to a little bit over the hundreds on on, on special defense and it's just like he's super super strong or super defensive super defensive but uh yeah so jim jeffries will like will do it he did he did this joke about it about or it's more so a rant about it it's just like it's like you it's like it's like, will you circumcise your son? Do you you don't you don't love your son? It's like, no, I love my son because because I want him to get laid because because <laughs> women In are more America. Women are more uh, yeah yeah women are more scared of that and don't know how to deal with that and they, they think it's gross and all this different stuff like that. You know, why not remove it all together so someone will suck his dick? <laughs> so so uh, be, be, because that is more gross than foot fetish. You fuck. <laughs> Gotta catch him up. So he's like, I love my son. <laughs> I want him to get laid. I'm just like, that is the best rant ever about it's that. It's not very effective. Ugh. Because he's a poison type and he's just going to beat the shit out of me if I don't swap. This is it's one, of my, one of my favorite Jim Jeffries jokes because he's a, he's a very uncensored comedian. Yeah, yeah. I love it. He's Ozzy, right? Yes. Ozzy, Ozzy, Ozzy. Oh, that, that's oh, why oh, he oh, does oh. the... Uh, uh, that's why he took over Colbert's job? No. Uh, no, it... Uh, he had... He, is it just the Jim Jeffries show is what I'm thinking of? I don't know, but it's... But it's on Comedy Central. Yeah. Um, There's no more Colbert Report, so... Um, I, think it was, I think he took over the Daily Show. What no, that's did. um. What's his name? Yeah, then yeah, does yeah. He 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 took over essentially what Comedy Central wanted, uh, what Comedy Central did with uh, the Colbert Report. So Trevor Noah did the Daily yeah, Show. Yeah, Trevor Noah is the Daily and then, Show. And uh, then who's Jim, South African? And then Jim Jeffries essentially is doing what Colbert did. Yeah. And I just thought I thought that was great. I was like, it's the per it's one of the perfect persons to do that because he's so unfiltered. 
Do they still have the nightly show or whatever it was called? The or? late show and then the late late show. No, no, there was the uh, no. They still have that. No, that that's, that's CBS. No, I'm talking about the the like the all black Daily Show that they had with Larry. What's his name? I don't know. That was a thing for a bit. I don't know if it made it though. Let me. Uh, what was it called? Was it called the Nightly Show? Am I tripping on that? Am I being racist? That sounds it's a little familiar. dark in here. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Smile, darkness. We can't see you. Oh, <laughs> such a terrible joke. Although to be honest, that would scare the live, living shit out of me if that if that actually happens. Like yeah, with Larry Lim Wilmore. Oh, yeah, that would that would that would scare the ever living uh, ever living shit out of me if I if I was like in a dark the ever living shit. Um, uh, if I was in a dark part of town, and I didn't see anything at all until just like I see a pair of teeth. <laughs> Because <laughs> someone's smiling, I don't care. I don't care if it's you know, what ethnic background or whatever. I do. I do enjoy. There was a there was a, a subreddit or something that just posted bright prom pictures. <laughs> where it was like, like a whole group of white kids, and they had like their black friend, and you couldn't see them because like yeah, the, the, the it, backdrop was like dark or something. And so there's like the the it is is you can totally you know uh, take pictures of white people and black people together. But you have to have the right kind of lighting. Because if you yes, don't, you the oh, the if you have like the camera set to auto the, or something the like white, that, the white tone will of the, of, out. Yeah, the, the lighter skin, the it will overblow, and so then the, you won't either, either the white people's faces will be like angels, like whoa, like super white, or the black people's faces will be super dark and you can't see. And so all yeah. you see is like a pair of teeth and like whites of their eyes, maybe. And if I if I if I freaking saw like Cheshire Cat kind of shit happening, well, that's in, different. Yeah, in an alley, it's like I, I don't care. Nope, just I don't keep care going. who you are. I'm just uh, I'm just pooping my pants and leaving. You can follow me. You can follow me by the sound of, uh, by the smell of my shit. But if you're doing that, then you're, I mean, you're committed to your freaking job. Oh yeah, yeah. So yeah, it got canceled. It was only on for a year. Really? Yeah. I think what it was is <clears throat> just. I mean, obviously, it had poor ratings, but. I remember, like, I was kind of like, oh, this might be pretty good, because he was part of the Daily Show cast. Yes. And then, I, oh, this could be pretty good, you know? Like, I get what they're kind of going for. But he would have, like, just really stupid people on his panels. Like, yeah, it was like, he did, like, a panel show. It was, like, him, and, like, they'd have, like, three or four comedians or or personalities, actors, celebrities, even yeah, re reality star celebrities, whatever. And they would usually not always be black, but there was, like, this kind of... It was kind of black centric like uh, viewpoints on specific, it. Specific like um, setting to try and get. Yeah, they were going for a specific demographic. It was his demographic, and and but I think what it, what it was is that he'd have like this just like I mean like I remember he had um what's his name on Bill Nye, science guy. Oh yeah. They had him on, and the people he had on were asking the stupidest, dumbest questions and saying the stupidest, dumbest things, and it made them look ignorant and stupid. And I remember like people were like I can't watch this show like they're. It's not good, and I think that uh, that might have what killed it eventually. And even if it got better, sometimes it's too late when you lose yeah. it at the core. That you know, when you lose it off of the start. But I didn't know. I, I wasn't sure if it had got canceled or not. But yeah, it's been a while now. It's been two. It's going on. It's been two years. Yeah, two and a half years now. Yep. Bye, 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 Drutini. We're gonna go heal you up, buddy. Can I heal you up, buddy? Do all the healings. All right, so we had to go through that whole process because we had to get the poke flute. The poke flute? Because, uh... Um, we skip pipes with it? No. Go to different worlds? Nope. Oh. Not quite. Um, we're gonna... Actually, I'm gonna set it up so I'm prepped to catch a certain Pokemon. <gasps> Jackie John! Yeah, he just finished that, that whole tower for us. So I kind of want to avoid... Um, I want to avoid fighting here, because, damn it, of course you would turn around. <laughs> you want to be at full health when you get there? Not so much full health, I just wanted to, I don't, I don't necessarily need to train at the moment. It's Goldeen. Um. What's the fish's name in Pinocchio? Oh, I don't remember. Because she kind of looks like that. Yeah. Well, cause she was she, gold, she was a goldfish. I, I assume it's gender without even like, looking. 
They, uh, Geppetto did refer to her as a she. No, I'm talking about this particular fish. Oh, well, that's a male. I know. <laughs> so I said I assumed the gender. I find it funny. So it's like they call that a um, a goldeen, but it's more akin to um, a koi. A koi? Yeah, well, it could be a golden koi. I don't know if that's a thing. But I don't know either. The name of the fish is what? Where's the name of the fish? Go. Cleo. Oh, yeah, that's right. Cleo. Yeah, because it's uh, Italian. Yeah, and Figaro is the cat. Yeah, I forgot there was a freaking cat. Yeah, it was a cute little kitty. Little black and white cat. When it comes to Disney, when it comes to, like... They don't do cats a lot, honestly. When they do cats, it was, it was just, it was just, just Lucify to me. <laughs> Lucify? Lucify. <laughs> oh, I love that. Who names their cat Lucifer? That crazy stepmom? That crazy stepmom. That evil woman. She's probably one of the most evil, outside maybe Mother Gothel, because she literally raised this kid and still treated him like shit. Oh yeah. At least Mother Gothel feigned love, so she thought she was loved, which I don't know if that's better or worse. They obviously had an unhealthy yeah. relationship, but jeez, that evil stepmother was, that's pretty evil. Oh yeah. No, she was like, she was dark. <laughs> yeah, she was. Well, she locks that door on Cinderella. Lucifer. <laughs> Cinderella. Son of a bitch. <laughs> How, <laughs> the people in this, these towns are very confrontational. Yeah, and I'm just I see you there. I'm fishing, but I'm going to kick your ass with my I'm Pokemon just, first. I'm just trying to avoid it because I don't, I don't have to fight all of these because I can just grind off camera. Um, instead of just like... Making this frustrating. It's like I'm, I'm saving evolution, so it's like it's it's shown for you and everyone else. But yeah. it's like I was so mad though when like we were literally one level away from teaching Jackie Chan all these freaking amazing elemental punches. <laughs> Use water sport. It's literally reducing the amount of fire damage. Which okay, so this was. Be careful when looking up water sport, kids. Yeah, don't <laughs> do, don't Google that ever. <laughs> um. So, th this is one thing I find really stupid, so, um... Even in a, per even in a, even in a competitive Pokemon setting, um... The moves, like, these different sport moves that they have, like, they reduce the damage of, um... Water sport reduces the damage of fire types, mud sport reduces the damage of electric types, but naturally... Those typings that would learn those moves already have a resistance to it. Yeah. So it's like, what's the point? Wouldn't you want to give that to something that's weak to it? So it can reduce the damage and possibly survive it? I don't know. It's, it's one thing that bugged me about um, this guy. I guess you could use that Pokemon to put it on and switch Pokemon to something else. But even in a competitive setting, that's a, that's a waste of a turn where you can just do a stat increase to negate it better. Yeah, I know what you're saying. I'm just... Yeah, it's just... Oh, is that wake up the Snorlax? Wake up the Snorlax! I'm in a grumpy rage! Are we gonna catch a Snorlax? Yup. Oh, my sound is on. <laughs> Just got a message over um, Discord. Alright, so we're gonna put him to sleep. Oh, wow, you're gonna put him back to sleep. I love it. Oh, is he susceptible right. to sleep? He is very susceptible to sleep, but I just forgot that uh, this is this is better than Gen One uh, Snorlax. So yeah, he cures himself from waking up. Uh, but you can only do that once because you can only eat a berry once in 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 battle. And he he bumped into me and went to sleep. <laughs> I love so it. So here's my question: Snorlax, is this the, is this its original form? Uh, Does it have a smaller form? It has a baby form that got introduced in this generation. It's called Munchlax. And is there a form after Snorlax? No. Unless there's a Mega Snorlax that I don't know about, but uh, yeah. So it's just a Pokemon that likes to sleep? It's that likes to sleep, but, but it's baby form Munchlax likes to eat. Oh, that makes sense. So, so then it's like it, in hibernation So now. then when it evolves, it goes into hibernation. Ah, that's funny. So is, 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 what is the point of having Snorlax as a pet? Is he just like a tank or something? He is a massive tank. Um, and Snorlax is one of those Pokemon because he just did, used a move called Snore that lets him do um, that lets him do damage while he's asleep. 
Oh no, he's 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 drowsy. He gave he he cast yawn, and what yawn does is it'll put a Pokemon to <gasps> but sleep. But it failed. It puts a Pokemon to sleep two turns two turns after it's used. Ah. And so now my Parasect is asleep. Ba ba da. All right, all right, all right. Uh, Pokeballs. I only have nine. Didn't realize I only had nine. All right, really? Didn't. Uh. Because I don't want to have to wake up to try. Oh, and it's a girl Snorlax, too. Ooh, that. it's a female Snorlax. Oh, yeah, so it's funny. The only way you can actually evolve uh, Munchlax into Snorlax is you need to give it an incense to relax it. <gasps> we caught us a Snorlax! All right. Snorlax. Do you want to nickname it? Sure. Because I might use him. He's a, he's a pretty pretty strong Pokemon. Uh, let's go with a G. A space. Uh, P, or no, M. We'll go M. A. There it is. Gma. Gma. Yep, Gma. Grandma. Yep, she's asleeping. Because I remember last second that it's a girl. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're going to go check in here because there's a certain item I want to see if I can get. Not sure if it's in this house or another. Yep, I think it's in this house. Uh, 30 species, so I'll give you a reward. That's item fighter, never mind. Drat. Okay. But that's going to end this episode. Uh, that'll end this episode of Nightly Nerds. As always, I'm Tote. And I'm Ginger. And we'll catch you guys on the flippy, 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 flippy side. Bye bye. Hey, did you like that video? Well, if you did, click the box on the right for another. Click the box on the left for a playlist. Of course, you could always just subscribe by clicking the link in the middle. Come find us on social media. There are links in the description below. Don't be afraid to leave us a comment. Thanks for watching. I'm Tote. I'm Ginger. See you then. Bye.